So this is a little different than the videos we usually do. Is this some advanced E3 footage? It's, let's see, it seems to be a trailer of some variety. For Left to Rot? Oh, nothing hypes me up like government power. <laughs> the I can't tell if it's concept art or the game, which is usually a bad sign, but... You never know, I guess, right? Other sinful things we could think of. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh, Panzer Gaming, yeah. I, I love them. Oh yeah, they're my favorite. They do the best sort of like parallelogram kind of trapezoidal trailer things. And they know how to use the polygon split and bomb tools in whatever 3D modeling program this is. FPS and RTS combined, two things you never wanted married. And now you can pay for it on Kickstarter! Oh, wow. I know. This I is... would sign up if it did not reach its funding goal on May 7th, 2012. Hey guys, my name is... <laughs> um, yeah, no, you can't have the trailer lead to this. Greed, violence. <laughs> one other individual of the name of Anna Burner. Anna Burner and myself started this company primarily... <laughs> so he's kickstarting a Supergirl Assassin's Creed crossover? That's how much I like video games, stock footage of controllers. Our love has turned into an obsession, and our obsession has brought us to a... Hey, I couldn't get my trailer kickstarted, okay? Did, did I mention I like Assassin's Creed? Do you like Gears of War? Well, I have an idea that's much more terrible. Do you like it? Give, give me your money! Now, I'm talking about jobs for the people that are going to school for video games, that have graduated, that want internships, and simply have no so, um, experience. That is can, where can I, can I uh, tell you how, how far this got to its goal? Well, or what do you think it's say what the goal is? The, they wanted $41,000 okay. for their zombie apocalypse game. Sure. They got 189. And from 10 people. Nine of which were him. Now, fortunately, though, we do get the game footage, if you were curious. Oh, good. <laughs> Maybe this was an, uh, an undiscovered gem. Something we could have, you know... All right, let's see. So far, we do have the Michael Bay ripoff kind of deal. Very good. To why my Kickstarter wasn't funded. <laughs> this is a lot like the trailer at the beginning of this, but all right, here we go. Left to rot. I just said that trailer. The Kickstarter itself was left to rot, though, wasn't it? <laughs> so the title makes sense both ways. Right. Now, this is an original... Co oh, God. I've never yeah. heard of Dead Rising before. <laughs> wow, the frame rate looked incredible there. <laughs> like Silky I said, I need funding to finish this. Silky smooth graphics. And you're saying for 41 grand I can have this, but better? This is a Newgrounds game, right? Why are the zombies just exploding into Kool-Aid like that? So the enemies are pop scares, not so much zombies. Right. <laughs> that hick zombie won't stop <laughs> hugging us. I need anything. more frames. <laughs> frames. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, this, this is just opening my wallet magically. I Wait, isn't this the same footage like over and over again? So and, uh, this didn't open the floodgate to bank vaults of cash being poured onto this project? <laughs> Why are there so many hillbilly zombies? Oh my god, the exploding windmill! <laughs> That's the final takeaway! Is that supposed to be an FPS Matrix dodge right there? <laughs> oh my, I've never seen anything more awesome than a windmill being blown up! Well, I think we oh. know this actually won't be how it ends. <laughs> yeah. This Spoilers. Now that you see what left to ride is, let me tell you a little bit about where we want to be. We want to be much better than that <laughs> trailer. I need to find a better fitting shirt as well. Call of Duty, Battlefield, blood pumping game. That is where we want to be. We are going to implement RTS features and combine those with FPS. Well, wow, Adam Sessler looked at those hand gestures and thought, that's a bit much, man. Over time, I'll have to edit a little there. <laughs> One Adam of the takes Turner, didn't go Jessica up. Jimerson, Josh Young, Marlon Cheechman, the Alex Marlon Cheechman, even the success of Left to Rot. Now, based upon that success, they believe in me. All right, now I'll fund it. <laughs> they believe. In <laughs> and I have a great understanding of tone for a post-apocalyptic game. We work day out. Sometimes, guys, we work. See, it's it's not left 
four dead, it's left to rot. It's totally different. Come on, man, he works 60 hours a week. See, that took at least 40 hours of the work week. <laughs> That's where the 189 they raised got went to. Now, we all know how big E3 actually is, but due to the lack of funds, we cannot attend the So, they got invited to E3 somehow, and basically they can't afford to go, is the... So, I have the feeling this is less a real game thing you were funding, and just more like a little trip for them. Fun to my plane ticket, too. Imagine you fucking showed that at E3. You'll be able Wait, to see the right hand side of my screen? Yeah, uh. Around, you can walk away like this guy right here. Yeah, why was the earth shaped like an egg? Now, I appreciate your time, and thanks for watching. You're welcome. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? But fight, fight the resistance, as in the resistance you have to giving this money. Yeah, I'll, I'll get right on that. Mm-hmm. Oh, man, um... Let's see here. You pledge a dollar or more. Eh, you're just, you're a corpse level, but eh, you're just a corpse. But you get your name in special thanks sessions. At least there's that. Good, good. Um, four people backed that. <laughs> Do you see. think those four people were like, no way. <laughs> <laughs> but, eh. Oh, awesome. Ten dollars or more, and you can uh, name yourself out of one of the buildings in the game. What? <laughs> yep. Uh, yeah. wait, and then I'm looking at the description. I don't think they understand Kickstarter, because, um, if we don't reach the our goal with the funds, don't worry. We will utilize every penny to the max of our ability to still bring you a great game all around. Some sacrifices will have to be made, but we'll still reward you for pledging, and you still will have contributed to a fun game. No, that's not how it works. You don't get the money. I like. I really like to think he didn't realize that when he made it. And at the end of this, it's like, oh shit. Let's see, at twenty five dollars, ooh, you get the beta of the game, which is what I thought was just shown. Whoa! Mm. And uh, five advanced UDK tutorials, ooh. so you can make your own game. That enticed no one. <laughs> um, one person pledged fifty dollars or more, and oh, they have their backstory in the journal. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> Their backstory is how they pledged $50. Yes. And how they were fools. Um. Oh! For $100, you get a signed poster of our future team of superstars. There's more and than that, one? They, they had a backer, which I am going to bet anything was the guy we saw at that. <laughs> <laughs> he wrote out the reward and was like, ooh. I want that. God damn, you can... Come on, man. Pledge $10,000 or more. $10,000. you will be an executive producer. You can advertise in the game. No, you can't. Your funding ran out. You gave $10,000. <laughs> oh, God. And there's a terrible joke. Uh, if you're $10,000 or more, lastly, once the game is complete, we'll hold a company, company assembly in your honor and feed you some delicious food. With nothing infected, of course, we would hate to our, see our top contributor turn to a flesh eater. Or would we? <laughs> uh, nice, nice. Well, <laughs> left to rot turned out to be a very appropriate name after all. It, 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 did, it did indeed do that. Yeah. Well, left to rot? Left to rot. <laughs>